Welcome to new techno news channel. Please don't forget to subscribe to my channel and like the video. Citing wealth information, the German government has agreed to deliver 7 PZH 2155mm self-propelled howitzers to Ukraine. This decision comes after the announcement by Holland to deliver the same type of howitzers to Ukraine. The German PZH 2000 howitzers delivered to Ukraine will come from the Army military inventory. According to the Military Balance 2021, the German army has a total of 121 PZH 2000 in service. Citing German military sources, only 40 of the 121 PZH 2000 are operational and indispensable to not reduce the operational capabilities of the German army. The Panzerhobitz 2000, Armored Howitzer 2000, abbreviated PZH 2000, is a German 155mm self-propelled howitzer developed by Krauss Maffei Wegmann, KMW, and rain metal for the German army. The PZH-2000 is one of the most powerful conventional artillery systems deployed in the 2010s. It is capable of a very high rate of fire, in burst mode it can fire 3 rounds in 9 seconds, 10 rounds in 56 seconds, and can depending on barrel heating, fire between 10 and 13 rounds per minute continuously. The PZH-2000 has automatic support for up to 5 rounds of multiple rounds simultaneous impact, MRSI. The replenishment of shells is automated. Two operators can load 60 shells and propelling charges in less than 12 minutes. PZH-2000 has also been selected by the armies of Italy, Netherlands, Greece, Lithuania, Hungary, Qatar and Croatia, mostly replacing older systems such as the M109 howitzer. In 1986, Italy, the United Kingdom and Germany agreed to terminate their existing development of the PZH 155 to 1 program, which had run into reliability problems and had design defects, notably being mounted on a modified tank chassis. A new joint ballistics memorandum of understanding, JBMOU, for a 52 caliber barrel, based on a UK proposal, to replace 39 caliber was nearing an agreement. German industry was asked for proposals to build a new design with gun conforming to the JBMOU. Of the proposed designs, Wegmans was selected. Wegman eventually won a contract in 1996 for 185 units to be delivered to Germany's Rapid Reaction Force, followed by another 410 for the main force. Rainmetal designed the 155mm 52 caliber JBMOU compliant rifled gun, 60 rifles, right hand spiral, which is chromium lined for its entire 8M length and includes a muzzle brake on the end. The gun uses a new modular charge system with six charges, five identical, which can be combined to provide the optimal total charge for the range to the target as well as the conventional bag charge systems. Primer is loaded separately via a conveyor belt, and the entire loading, laying and clearing, is completely automated. The maximum range of the gun is 30 to 36 kilometers with the standard DM-121 boat tail round, about 40 to 47 kilometers with base bleed rounds, and 67 kilometers with M2005 VLAP assisted projectiles. In April 2006 a PZH-2000 shot assisted shells, Denel VLAP, over a distance of 56 kilometers with a probable maximum range of over 60 kilometers. The gun can also fire the Smart 155 artillery round, which is used by Germany and Greece. Wegman supplied both the chassis, sharing some components with the Leopard 2, and the turret for the gun. The system has superb cross-country performance because of its use of continuous tracks and considerable protection in the case of counterfire. The turret includes a phased array radar on the front glassy for measuring the muzzle velocity of each round fired. Laying data can be automatically provided via encrypted radio from the battery fire direction center. In December 2013, Raytheon and the German Army completed compatibility testing for the M982 Excalibur Extended Range guided artillery shell with the PZH-2000. Ten Excaliburs were fired at ranges from 9 to 48 km shells hit within 3M of their targets, with an average miss distance of 1M at 48 km. The Excalibur may be accepted by the German army in 2014.